Yeah, I like the mancini better than this one. Than that one? Yeah. Yeah, it's like this was my You, you know, you've been eyeing the mancini, Anthony. Like, ever since I met you, you wanted you an 1104 mancini. mancini. I did, but see, now I, I loved it. I liked it before I had one. But now I've had titanium. You want and I, 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 I kind of want rose for my next one, dude. And I wore yours. I wore that one last night. It's I just love that it gets one. so many looks. Yeah, for sure. And, like it draws your. That eye thing to screams, it. bro. I'm in the front by your car. You're in the front by my car. Okay, right, so I guess. Just the, the entrance right by my car. You come into the building and then come to the tunnel. Oh, there it is. Yo. What's up? I'm at Neil's. I'm about to do some uh, some RM shopping. Okay. Don't buy an RM right now. Maybe. Don't. <laughs> We'll see. I'm gonna FaceTime you when I get in here. Bro, focus on getting that uh, that rainbow, please. I know, I'm gonna see what he offers me on mine and see what he has. What's up, buddy? Hey, doing all right? To you. you too. What's up, bro? What's up, what's up? Good. You don't get hangovers. Oh, I feel great. <laughs> I worked out this morning, went up, sat on the pool. Look at this. What's this one? That's the RM11 Black Knight. It's uh, Felipe Massa. The case is solid NTPT, and there's only 100 of that watch in the world. Yeah, very exclusive. What's the market price on this one? The market price on that piece today is $400,000. Wow. Yeah. On this one? That's an RM30 Asia exclusive. I actually forgot. I think there's 30 in the world of this watch. We set it up on the baby blue. You know that's our signature. Oh, no, I love, yeah. the, I love the baby blue. Um, yeah, all carbon, super light. I love the gold accents inside the dial. It's stunning for a 30. Here's yeah. One of your favorites, right? This is one of my favorites, yeah. This is the one that's... It's the RM1101, the Roberto Mancini. Um, stunningly set up on that 1103 green strap. Looks killer. What's the market price on this one? 235. 235? Yeah. That's box papers? Yes. That's the Le Mans, yeah. It's 150 pieces, titanium. What's the market on this one? Okay. Two and a quarter. RM10 titanium. Yes, sir. What's the market on one of these? That watch today is, it's naked. I can do it for 130. Okay. Yeah. Market's like 140 on these. All right, what's this? What is that? That's an RM1102. It's a GMT. It's a dual time zone and it's a chrono as well. I just changed the strap on that. Market price? Today that watch is 265. So you want that's like really jumping out at me is this 30. Man, I love, you love the 30. 30s. I do love the 30. It just it fits my wrist so well. So that one's complete 250,000. Titanium's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, titanium sides. 250. 250, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is rare. I like when you do that. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about this one. I love this too. That's the Johan Blake. Uh, named after the runner, Johan Blake, and it's got the Jamaican theme going. This comes in a white TPT, right? It comes in white TPT. That's, That's the one I was we were working morning, on it yeah. today, yeah. What's, so what's the difference in price on this one? Huge difference. That yeah. one's more than double the price of this. These are trading for around 300000 today, mm -hmm. whereas the white, the ultimate edition, is trading for 700000 wow. So Damn, that's... How much that's is that? Beautiful. And That's an RM29, uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, 150,000. Complete. Is that's, a, that's a good watch. Yeah. RM29. But for you, this it's going to be a downgrade, is... basically. It's not for me. For, for, for me. Andrea, okay. <laughs> <It's> for me. <laughs> You're a lucky but, girl. Yo, you get a bracelet and a, and a, a Richard Meal. <laughs> not, not a watch. Not that lucky. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually cheap, bro. This is like a retail banger. Is that an aftermarket? Aftermarket crystal, okay. but it comes with the original case, too. Ew. 
Yeah. But I like that already. But, but Richard Mille makes this sapphire, like, mm -hmm. when Richard Mille makes it, it's like a two and a half million dollar watch. Wow. This I can sell for 165. Because it's aftermarket. Yeah. But it comes with the original white gold diamond case, too. That's cheap, bro. If you have a lady client for an RM, that's a good watch. Dude, this is that one from last night. How much is this one? This, this is one's going to be 300,000. 1103 rose gold and titanium. 1102. 1102. Yeah, GMT. What's the difference in 1102 and 1103? 1103, it's a bigger case. This is a 46 millimeter. That's a 48 millimeter. And then this is a GMT. It's a dual time zone, whereas 1103, it's just a split second chrono. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I do like that. Mm. Love it. Sorry, it's a flyback chrono. Flyback. Chrono. Not a split second chrono. <laughs> Testing my knowledge, bro. <laughs> What's this one? That is just a plain Jane RM10 white gold. Great entry level men's Richard Meal. Today that watch is going to be around 140,000. That's not bad, actually. Mm -hmm. That's like the perfect case size. Like for someone getting into RM from Rolex, Omega, stuff like that, you, this is a wearable watch. It's the right. best size. So like You need to start pushing more RM, bro. I'm trying. So. I'm considering trading in the RM30, and these are the contenders. The Mancini, the 1102 Flyback Chrono, and the RM30 Rose Gold. Yeah, I like the Mancini better than this one. And that one? Yeah. Yeah, it's like this was my You, you know, you've been eyeing the Mancini, Anthony. Like, ever since I met you, you wanted you an 1104 Mancini. Mancini. I did, but see, now I, I loved it. I liked it before I had one. But now I've had titanium. You want and I've, I, I kind of want rose for my next one. Dude, and I wore yours. I wore that one last night. It's I just, love that it one. gets so many looks. Yeah, for sure. And, like, it draws your that eye. That thing screams, it. bro. So let's talk numbers. Your buy price on that. back back where exactly how I sent it to you. Yeah. Okay, which I didn't lose any money to wear an RM. Mm -hmm. But you should have sold it when you got offers for. Mm -hmm. It was an impulse. <laughs> you should have sold <laughs> I know, it. But... That's what you're gonna do now, right? You're gonna buy yeah. it and actively like if you get an offer, bro, yes, sell yes. it. So I'll now, you can now, call me, bro. I'll ship you another one tomorrow. Know, right? Like now that I've had like I've had it for a while and I've gotten to wear the same one. I've had the appreciation. Now it's to the building phase where I buy, sell, buy, sell. Yeah, buy, let's sell. do that. That's how I, I started. Want to get to a McLaren or the easy. How do I say it? I'm gonna say it wrong. What the Pablo McDonough? McDonough. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that one's the goal. Yeah. Your price on that is. It looks nice even on, on a black. blue strap. A any color will look good any on color that. Would look yeah. good. Yellow will look crazy. The red one. I don't know why yeah, yellow orange. yellow makes the what gold orange on this orange will look orange. good too so you want a red for a 30 right Anthony? yes okay and what else or black for a 30 or black for a 30 you get the grooves of this screw I'll show you on the next screw right in between the teeth of this pin like you don't want to I'll show you so you see how the the pin here is four f there's four points to it yep so this screw's got four points to it. Okay. So you make sure the teeth of this go in between the teeth of this, the screw on the watch. Okay. As soon as you see it, it fit right in, just start turning counterclockwise. Turn a little. There it is, the screw comes right out. Nice. Easy as that. So this is gonna go here, because this is your watch. This I'm gonna put here. This is your additional strap, sir. You want to do it, Anthony? Yes, you can try. Sure. Okay. So, which, okay. so the long side goes on the bottom of the watch, the longer side of the strap. That's detach the it, detach okay. it fully first. Yep. The longer one goes on the bottom, just remember that. It'll slide right just in. Slides right in. Yeah. So when you start it, when it, when it starts to get tight, just stop. Like, yeah. Don't don't go crazy. Yeah, just on do the other one. Mm -hmm. So even when you get them both in, you don't want to tighten them all the way. Tighten it, but like, because that's what not. makes it waterproof, water resistant, but like, you don't want to go too crazy. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. Make sure you don't lose these rings around the screw, bro. You, you saw that, right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's important because that's what keeps the water resistant seal. Okay. Yeah. Nice. Looks fire on you, bro. That's the Aventador yeah. Excalibur. Some 
limited uh, 88 pieces in the world. Look at that. Look at that. Do you know what the retail is on this? 212,000. What's it sell for in the, like, one? I haven't seen any being traded, but we're asking uh, 145 per hour. It's literally, I thought, 140, 145, 150. Dude, I love Sick watch. watch. I, I owned one of those watches, bro. I got it for free. Really? Yeah. Um, what's we all, his name? Are, uh, your, your dad's company is a... AD for Zenith. Yeah. ADs, right? So, what's his name? Rick Delacroix. So he's like the CEO of Hublot Zina. Yeah. He, I, I made a crazy sale at the show, like 15, 20 Hublots, and he gifted me the Zina. He's like, take that AP off your wrist. Put this on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, bro, your strap is in here. Okay. And your tool and your crown are in here. That's Let me get the not for sale box. There's so much good shit in there, I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> the sold box. Dude, that's what, that's what our office is like. You come in on like, Thursday and we're getting everything ready for Friday shipping and people Thursdays for some reason are our busiest day and people come in they're like do you have this no I just sold you have yeah. this no I just sold Show them well, I was looking at this this and this on your website yeah they're all in the sold bin <laughs> okay so every time you come to Miami bro one night out at least oh, of course if you wanted to know why two six three three ones keep going up it's because time. I like the blue don't get me wrong but Dude. The part is whenever we sell them, we always have to pay more to replace them. Right. The Panda, in my opinion, is much better. So this is something pretty special. I've never actually even seen one of these in person. Oh. Look at that. Look how good these two look together. Look at that. So what's this sell for today? That's right under 300000 today. Comes in white and black ceramic. Yeah, the black is like two fifty. White's closer to 300. Yeah, it feels it's nice. Crazy. Dude, that, that's crazy. Like thinking, I mean, obviously RM, but. No, but this, this is like RM category. This is like RM league, bro. That looks crazy Okay, on I you. didn't like it before <laughs> that much. It looks really good on you. I already bought well, one. I guess it's the <laughs> outfit, bro, because you're wearing a white t-shirt. Like, yeah. Blue, blue jeans, yeah. I gotta call my I gotta call my investor. <laughs> but that's sold, bro. But we'll get no, one. I know, we'll get one. He's he's hanging out with Marco right now. What up? Hello, get out of here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> show, show the investor. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's it. It sold. What are you guys up to? You sold it? It sold already. Yeah, what happened to the tape on this? Oh, this is sold, yeah, right? I was just calling to show y'all. Okay. Like right under 300. Look at this factory okay. diamonds, bro. Oof. Actually, put the hey, put lot. the investor back on the phone. Get out of He's not gonna like that. I know, but I do. He likes perpetuals, <laughs> right? Show, show him the. Ooh, I saw his face. That's oh, you know what? Oh, hey, you should put the investor back on the phone. <laughs> Hang on, don't gosh. don't get the camera though. Uh... Hang on, slow mo. Dun dun what is dun, this dun, dun 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 dun. <laughs> what is this? It's old. She's not very happy with that. She's not very happy. <laughs> we 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 got her on another one. Uh, we have another one. Yeah. Um, okay, you got another one. How much? We'll How much was this sold for? Just told him. The fifty-seven forty G. Can you check Oof. on XL? Man, I love that watch. He's got another one for sale, right? Can you check All this right, so That's the fifty-seven forty G. White gold. I'm curious to see what the price is that this just sold for because I sold this watch three months ago for 210000 So let's see what it sells for today. All right, so my client, I know you're watching this. You bought this watch and I told you to get it and don't even hesitate. You paid two ten. This is a 2019 pre-owned complete. Mm -hmm. it sold for two forty five. dollars His was 2021 brand new. That's f***ing insane. Okay, yeah, well, three months he made... 60 grand on his watch. That watch was undervalued. Grand. The fact that a 5981R is the same Dude, price this, as this. This watch, this is the, like, I don't like the size of the 5711. Hey, all right, I'll call you back, Marco. Um, I don't like the size of the 5711 just because it's, it's too small for my wrist. Uh, and then the blue on the 5711, it just, I don't know, it doesn't yeah. look. It's a basic watch, bro. It doesn't yeah, look 100,000 at all. This, the contrast, with this blue dial on white gold and the weight of it makes this 
like a killer, killer piece. Oh, look at that, his and hers. Yeah, oh, so nice together. Y'all have the newer dial of this, I think, right? Yeah, the, what's the? The graduating dial, yes. I, I forget what it's called. I love this Rolex for some reason. Meteorite Day Day Baguettes. I have that. What, in your personal? No. Nah, it's, I like that one a lot, and if I were gonna have a presidential, a white gold, that would be that one. Yeah. It's just, I know I would never. Wear it? I'd never wear it. So what did we do? Just the RM, right? The RM tree. Just the RM. <laughs> <laughs> just a quarter mil, bro. Actually, half a mil. <laughs> yeah, that was a half, almost half a mil. And revenue? Transaction. Right? Tally it up, traded in my uh, RM30 back at cost, which, which works. So I bought it for, sold it for, and you could have sold it for more, for but free. you were too in love with it. I did. I, I got offered a lot of money when I first got it, but I liked the watch and I wanted to wear it. First RM, had to show it some love. This one looks now. I'm going in the trading game. So I'm in this one. When I sell this one, I'm going to trade up, trade up, trade up, trade up. Keep on moving it. We got you. TPC cool. is going to take cool. care of you. And then we'll do another uh, low-key night when I'm back in Miami. For sure. <laughs> so, which may be pretty often. Uh, hope so. <laughs>